for more, and my business is cleaning. And I'm going to prove to you in the very next few minutes there's no magic in cleaning. You only have to know what to use and how to use it. So now that everyone can see exactly what's going on, I'm going to go up here to my shirt and I'll stain it. Not with one stain, but with about 11 of the hardest stains I can possibly think of to remove. Now, first of all, I'll take a strong medicinal stain. That's it. And I'll put that stain in the shirt. But now, if you think that's bad, that's nothing. Look. Next, I'll take some grease. Some gum oil of rotar I have in the container. I'll put that in the shirt, too. Then we'll see if I can take it out. We'll rub that right down into the material. Now, look. Have you ever sat down to the table? Have you ever spilled any salad dressing, mayonnaise, or olive oil in your best shirt or dress? Why, sure, we all have it one time or another. So I'll take the oil, and I'll put that in the shirt, too. Now, I think you'll have to admit I've got a pretty good stay in that shirt. In fact, if you had a garment in that condition, you might be tempted to throw it away. Or you would pay the dry cleaner 59 cents to $1.29 to remove it. Well, I'll show you how to remove those spots and stains in your own home. In fact, when I'm finished, I'm going to make it possible for each and every one of you to receive at our expense this dollar and fifty cent professional dry cleaning kit that you can use to remove those spots and stains in your own home. Now, I'll take the stains from the shirt, but I would like to say this too. In fact, the other day a lady said this, my husband wears out his shirt collars and cuffs so fast, is there anything I can do about it? Well, I said, ma'am, in the first place, there's not a man in the world who has a neck like sandpaper, and they do wash their neck once in a while. In fact, it's the ladies who wear the shirt collars out, and I'll show you what I mean. During the day, they wear a tight collar and tie. The acid and perspiration hits the ridge of that collar. Then when Monday comes, that's wash day, you ladies take those shirt collars, you'll look at them. You'll knuckle grumble a few words about George washing his neck once in a while, then you take that shirt collar, you dunk it, you rub it, you dunk it and rub it. Why, you give it more wear and tear in one washing than he could in six months of wearing look. I'll show you how to clean those shirt collars and cuffs without rubbing or scrubbing. Here's all you have to do. You take one capful of the cleaner to one quart of water. Now you take those spotted and stained materials. Take silk, gray, and nylon hose. Take washable linen, cotton, or wool fabrics to clean the materials. Here's all you have to do. You take those materials, you dip them. You dunk them, you submerge them, and you immerse them into the cleaner. Up and down five or six times. Now, if they're very dirty, let them soak a little while. Not so dirty, dip them up and down, hang them up, let them dry, and when they're dry, they're perfectly clean. I'll take the stains from the shirt for you, but I would like to say this too. You know, ladies, it's always cleaning time. And I know that you could very easily spend 50 to 75 dollars to have your rugs and upholstery clean with a dry cleaner. My friends, that's a lot of money. I'm sincere, I want to save you that money because I can show you how to clean all the rugs and upholstery in your home for a few cents. I said one cap full of the cleaner to one quart of water. Now when you're cleaning upholstery, if it's tapestry, mohair, velour, silk frisé, or silk brocatil, in the home or in the automobile, use a sponge. Now, not only is this good for rugs and upholstery, you can use it on woodworks, walls, Venetian blinds, Frigidaire's tile, Tilex and linoleum. Use it as a laundry aid in the washer. In fact, anything that's safe in water is safe in this cleaner, and it'll do a beautiful job every time. But I said on upholstery, you always use a sponge. Now, look, I guarantee our cleaner will go down, remove the dirt, the grime, the grease, the hair oil stains. In fact, make your upholstery look like new. Now, when you're cleaning rugs, you always use it just a little bit different. On rugs, you always use a brush. On Chinese, Oriental, Persian, or domestic, now look, I guarantee our cleaner will go down, remove the dirt, the grime, the grease, bring out colors in your rugs that you didn't even think were there. Now, when you're all finished on the rug, take a vacuum sweeper, go over the rug, and bring the nap up. On the upholstery, take a damp cloth and brush the nap so it lies down. Now I'll take the stains from the shirt. But my friends, I know I must have created a question in your mind. You say, what is the name of this product? How much does it cost? And where can I get it? The name of this wonderful new product is ProClean. That's ProClean. It comes in concentrated form, doesn't take up any room. It'll be selling very shortly in all of your leading department stores. This package, enough to make 10 gallons of cleaner, will sell for $5.98, and it's well worth it. There's enough cleaner right there 
to clean all the rugs and upholstery in the average home, from the attic right down to the basement, plus the upholstery in the automobile. But now, in order to get you to try ProClean, right away, now, today, forget the $5.98 I've mentioned. During this special advertising offer, I'm going to take the price of that package and cut it right in half. Not $5.98, but $2.98. And with every order of ProClean, we include absolutely free this $1.50 professional dry cleaning kit and the 18-page book of instructions that tell you just exactly how to use it. And my friends, don't let anyone fool you. You can't remove these spots and stains without a dry cleaning kit like this. Now, ladies and gentlemen, I want you to remember this. You're trying ProClean, you're not buying it. When you get ProClean into your home, the first thing I want you to do is to go over to the dirtiest rug or the dirtiest piece of upholstery you have in your home. And if you can't remove the dirt, the grime, the grease, the hair oil stain, make your rugs and your upholstery look like new, just like I'm doing right here. If you can't take your spotted and stained materials, your silk, gray, and nylon hose, washable linen, cotton, or woolen fabrics, Clean them just by dipping, dunking, immersing and submerging them into the cleaner. If you can't take your dry cleaning kit, if you can't go over to your shirts, dresses, blouses, hat suits, overcoats, neckties, if you can't remove those ink, grease, gum oil, road tar, paint, iodine, mildew, rust, and lipstick stains, just like I'll take the stains from my shirt, here's what I want you to do. In other words, you're trying ProClean with an ironclad written money-back guarantee. If it hasn't done everything for you that it's doing right here for me, in fact, more than you have to pay, it hasn't cost you a single penny. If you're not satisfied for any reason, I want you to keep the dry cleaning kit. That's yours, so thank you for having tried ProClean. I want you to send back the unused portion, and we'll send back through the mail every cent of your deposit plus the postage it costs to send it back. And my friends, I don't think anyone could be fairer than that. But you won't send ProClean back. You'll use it, you'll tell your friends and neighbors about it, and satisfied customers are our best advertisers. Now, ladies and gentlemen, I hit that shirt with everything but the kitchen sink. Eleven of the hardest things I could possibly think of. And I think you'll have to admit, for a quick job of cleaning, that's perfect. In fact, there's not a stop, a stain, or a ring left in that shirt. Now, ladies and gentlemen, for those of you who would like to try ProClean, right away, now, today, listen, please, to your local announcer.